What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel, King Ken TV. And today we're doing a post game recap on the New England Patriots versus the Carolina Panthers. Now, as you can see, and if you've been to the game, you watched the game, I'm sure you have, you saw that we lost 24 to 6 at home. Tough game, tough game. I think we learned a lot from this game, though. We learned a lot, man. In the first half, we kept it together. We kept it together, man. We made it respectable. It was only down by, I think, seven, eight points, 14 to six, going into halftime. We was going to get the ball back in the third, and I felt like we could have came out great. But then Sam Darnold, Sam Darnold, he, he showed his true colors once again. Very, very unfortunate what happened, man. Sam Darnold came out there and threw – 16 to 33 passes, completed 16 of them for 172 yards, but threw three interceptions. Got us to the red zone three times. One time we keep a field goal, the other two we threw, two interceptions. I mean, like, this game, I, I have low energy right now. This game just took everything out of me because of the – it, it put us, we got so many highs in this game. Like, we'll get so close, and then Sam Darnold just show why Bill Belichick has owned him for so long, man. Bill Belichick schemed up perfect defenses for anything we called. We couldn't do nothing. We couldn't do nothing. Even when we went to McCaffrey a couple of times, it seemed like we had success. Panthers was like, all right, let's go away from that. Play right into Bill Belichick's hands. It's, it's crazy how this game turned out. Let's go ahead and get into the game leaders, though. As you can see for passing yards, Mac Jones did his thing. He only threw the ball 18 times. One of them was interception from Gilly Lock. Then he threw a touchdown. Mac Jones didn't have a too crazy of a game, man. I know they won this game, which they did win this game pretty much with ease. But he didn't do too much in this game, like I said in the in the pregame. Like, I didn't really fear this dude because, you know, he, he, he doesn't – show me anything that would make me want to fear him. You know, he just – he seems like a game manager, you know. As far as running, bro, they they got three running backs, all of them. Decent backs, decent backs. They always getting good averages on each carry, man. It was gaining like three, four yards a touch. As you can see, Stevenson, he went for 10 carries on 62 yards. I mean, you can't get – you don't get no better than that when you got a three-man rotation. As far as uh, Christian McCaffrey, man, he didn't get too many touches like I thought. I thought he would have got like 20 carries and then like – nine, eight targets, maybe like seven catches. But, you know, we was just playing to safe. Gave him 14 carries for 52 yards. Sam did have him open on a little, uh, what is that, a post, a wheel route, you know, but that got batted down. He ended up being uh, our top wide receiver, four catches for 54 yards. So, overall, he had 100 yards, all-purpose yards on the ground. Nothing, nothing that C-Mac, we ain't used to. I mean, we, we used to this, man. C-Mac always does this. For them, they just had one wide receiver, uh, Stevenson, which he ain't even a wide receiver. He's a running back. He had two catches. They, like I said, bro, we beat ourselves in this game. We beat ourselves, bro. I don't, I don't know. Like, it was nothing that the that the Patriots really did. They had one drive where they, they got not lucky, but you know they just schemed up the perfect offensive call to our defensive call, where they got the little running back on the little screen play, and then he took that for yardage, and then they eventually capitalized on it. But other than that. They didn't do anything that made me like, dang, bro, like, we got we got with. We, we just we, – we it was all – bro, this game is on Sam. This game is on Sam. All this week you about to see videos coming out. Somebody has to get fired. Somebody has to get fired. Somebody needs to be cut. Somebody needs to be fired. Somebody needs to be cut. Somebody needs to let it be told how it is. I don't know if you've had the fan scene, but Rodney Anderson was going off. He was going off. Nobody else, everybody wants to be all nice and, you know, it's okay, Sam, you get them next time. No, no, bro. This is this is game almost 10 now. Why are we still holding Sam's hand? No, this is a grown man that's been in the league for four years. Stop babying him. He showed you who he is. It's like, it's like y'all don't want to believe it, man. It's like in relationships, man, when your girl cheating on you and cheating on you, or if, if your boyfriend cheating on you, cheating on you, and you just keep turning a blind eye to, oh, he going to do better, he give you some flowers, or she give you a little something, something, and now, now it's all good. No. And then they come right back and do this. Come on, man. Look at it for what it is. He's showing you who he is. He is showing you who he is, man. He's not it. 
Panther fans, you know, all these Sam Donald lovers, hey, where are y'all at? Where are y'all at, man? Where are y'all at now? Say, what's the what's the next excuse? Oh, he played Bill Belichick. This always happens. Come on, man. Go look at his stats now. This man got over 10 interceptions before his 10th game. He hasn't thrown a touchdown in how long? I, I mean, I don't know what else to tell you, bro. If you look at the team stats, man, New England, they like I said, they didn't do anything to us that made me feel like, dang, they they beat us, bro. Everything was was like this. Everything is really close. Look at this, bro. Only thing they really got us an edge on is like possession and first downs. But other than that, that's that's still close, bro. It's still close, man. I just I hate I hate games like this that it just you can't like okay put it all on. Excuse me, you just you just put it all on that. There's nothing I can put it all on, bro. This is it's crazy. It's crazy, man. It's crazy. I don't I don't get it, but. Panther fans, maybe y'all got it. Or New England fans, y'all tell me. Like, I understand, like, y'all y'all already said, man, this is what Sam Darnold does against the Patriots. But y'all let me know what, what was I missing because it didn't seem like y'all y'all just handed it to us. It just seemed like Sam Darnold just gave y'all the opportunities. And y'all really didn't capitalize on all of them. This game, y'all should have scored way more points. If I'm being realistic, y'all should have scored way more on all the opportunities he gave you. Y'all should have scored way more, but – this I don't know what to say, man. I do not know what to say. This this is gonna this is gonna be a tough week. This is gonna be a tough week. But other than that, make sure y'all leave a like, comment, subscribe, man. Make sure y'all go in the comment section and y'all hit me up. Let me know what y'all think. Let me know what y'all think. Other than that, that's gonna do it for this video, and I'll see y'all in the next one.